entertainmentbuddha.com Hey now everyone, Matt Haywood here from entertainmentbuddha.com and Haywood Pop on Instagram. How's it going? Hopefully it's going collectibly. So today we're checking out the prototype Samurai Fett, which is from the Tamashi Nation's movie realization line. Uh, it was an SDCC 2017 exclusive, excuse me, I'm stumbling over myself. Uh, but you, if you didn't make the show, a few other outlets had them. You know, I got mine from Big Bad Toy Store, so... Here he is. Um, he looks just like the previously released Boba Fett from the Tamashi Nation's line, except he's all white. I mean, that's really the only difference. So you know then that that means he's awesome. Um, highly detailed, great posability, uh, just just detail everywhere. I mean, in the, in the armor, in the sculpt, in the helmet. A um, few bummers though, and it's really nothing wrong with the figure. It's how it was shipped. Mine, his little targeting rectangle there in his helmet was already some somewhat snapped off by the time I got it so that's kind of a bummer these pauldrons fall off a lot as well I mean they're easily you can just snap them right back on but they seem to pop off more than you would like to so that's kind of a bummer as well but for the most part, for a display piece, I mean, this guy looks fantastic. I mean, he's going to look great in your collection. Uh, if you take uh, pictures of your toys, he also poses very well, so you'll be able to get some great pictures out of him. Plus, he has all sorts of uh, accessories, as you can see, to the left of the figure, which we will cover here shortly. Just stand up there, buddy. Stand for me, buddy. Come on, buddy. Hey, buddy. Come on, buddy. There you go, buddy. <laughs> Alright, excuse me again, sorry about that. So, he comes with his uh, kind of blaster. It's got the flintlock action with moving flintlock. Just like the standard Boba Fett from the Tamashii Nations line. Um, I mean, if you own any of these, you, you know the quality. I mean, these things are like museum pieces. Uh, he gets his katana with sheath. And then he has, what is it, I think five or six knives. He wears a few of them down on his shins and another one on his uh, left arm, that is. And then, of course, he's going to have multiple sets of hands, which we're getting here in a second. So he's got the fists. That's what he comes with. And then he comes with another four sets of hands, so... Two of them are for trigger fingers, two of them are to hold the stock of the gun, and then the other ones are meant for if he's holding the sword and whatnot. So plenty of customization options with this prototype Fett. I mean, like I said, he's just white. I mean, he's the same figure as the standard Boba Fett, but if you're like me and you need to have all these, then he's definitely worth picking up. So thanks for watching, everyone. Matt Haywood here signing off for entertainmentboo.com and Haywood Pop on Instagram. Hopefully you found this helpful. Like I said, you can probably get them out there in the wild now for about $130. Entertainment